But first, our top story right now is still developing. In the past hour or so, more crime scene technicians started scrubbing for evidence, apparently focused on the walls of a home in Titusville. We don't know what they are looking for, but we do know a missing woman, Anna Primavera, rented a room there. And during that investigation on Trinidad Avenue, Titusville police say they also came across evidence of child abuse. News 6's Lauren Cervantes is in Titusville. There's been a lot of police activity outside of the home tonight. I do want to show you this car behind me in the driveway. Police searched this car earlier, and we could also see in the window by the home, you could see CSI and police searching this room. The latest information from police is that the child abuse case is completely separate from the missing woman. A number of police vehicles are outside this home on Trinidad Avenue. Titusville police say they are searching for 36 year old Anna Primavera, who police say has been missing since Wednesday. Our biggest concern right now is this missing woman and we need to get information about her whereabouts. So if anyone has any information, we're strongly urging them to come forward. Anna's family sent News 6 these pictures of Primavera and say she was renting a room at this home. According to family, she'd only been staying there for the past couple of weeks. Police say they were investigating the case at the home when they saw a child there with bruises and scratches on her. Officers say they arrested 57-year-old Zhang Mu Wong on child abuse charges. Wong appeared before a judge this afternoon. I do find probable cause in this matter. State do you have a recommendation as to bond. Police say the child is now in DCF custody and say the child is known to Wong. Again, police tell us that the child abuse case is completely separate and Primavera's family tells us that she was not connected to Wong in any way other than the fact that she rented a room from him. In Titusville, I'm Lauren Cervantes getting results, News 6.